Two people are behind bars following a chaotic morning of multiple fights and fires on the east side of Sioux Falls. Prosecutors say it started with an argument after a young mother moved out of her boyfriend's apartment and into her parents' house and took her baby with her. The first 911 call came in at 3 o'clock Monday morning. Court papers say that's when Ahmed Mohammed started this car on fire right outside his girlfriend's parents' house. If you look closely, you can see a melted plastic gas can sitting on the trunk. Police believe Ahmed used it to start the fire. Then four hours later came a second call for the same address. The caller said he just set the house on fire. Authorities say Ahmed threw a Molotov cocktail through a window and flames quickly spread. Everyone got out safely, including his one-month-old daughter. Now, at that point, police decided to get a warrant and started searching for Ahmed. But the crimes didn't stop when his girlfriend went to a nearby high school. At 8.15, Council Mohammed walked into Washington High School. Attorneys say she was upset that her car and home had burned and was looking for someone. When administrators tried to stop her, police say she kicked and punched them and left. Minutes later, Council went to a home where court papers say her boyfriend lived and threw concrete chunks at another man who lived in the building. She's also accused of assaulting a correctional officer when she was brought to jail. Ahmed and counsel both appeared in court this afternoon. The judge set Ahmed's bond at $50,000 cash only. Counsel's bond is $10,000 cash only.